throughout our swampy wetlands and wilderness areas, there are various kinds of reptiles that call Florida home. Florida has taken major steps in recent years to protect our wildlife and ecosystem, and a way to do that is making the public more aware of invasive species. Now, we've talked a lot about the threat of Burmese pythons. Well, there's another invasive species that may be very eye-catching, but it's causing some big problems. ClickOrlando.com's Brandon Bowles is here now to show us this red-headed lizard. Very on trend with the... The hair. Yeah, you think so? I mean, so? it doesn't really have hair, but you know what I mean, <laughs> redheaded. Okay, well, when scientists at the University of Florida noticed an increase in sightings of Peter's rock agama, they knew it was time to ask the public's help in fighting yet another invasive species. And although these sightings are mostly in South Florida, it doesn't hurt to be more aware because they could make their way around the state. The Gamas are native to East Africa and were likely introduced to Florida as exotic pets nearly 50 years ago. Now, as you can tell, Candace pointed out, you can't miss them. Males have a bright reddish head and multicolored tail and the population is booming in South Florida. They're normally perched on a light post or strolling around a parking lot. And a big problem is that they love insects. And certainly butterflies are becoming endangered because of them. Scientists are asking the public to report the Peter's Rock Agama when they see it, because identifying the population is important to keeping a handle on it. And reporting is easy, too, because Florida also uses the I've Got One app for reporting invasive species. And since we're talking invasive animals, we figured now would be a good time to bring up this year's python challenge. Oh, I do not ever want to be this close to a snake. If you catch a Burmese python in the Everglades or any of Florida's public lands, you may get a reward. Governor Ron DeSantis says prizes will be awarded in both categories to those who catch the most and the longest pythons. The competition lasts 10 days and kicks off on July 9th. For more information on the Python Challenge and the Red-Headed Lizard, just head to ClickOrlando.com. We've got all the invasive species for you oh, yeah. guys.